Dr. Monteridas has been very focused in looking at the connection between cognition and how that has an effect on motor performance and how these two things are intrinsically linked together. We asked to our participants to walk and doing some calculations or to walk and name animals. We do that in a computerized math that we call electronic walkway so we can detect subtle changes in the velocity and subtle changes in the way they walk. So the thing we have demonstrated in our paper is people that walk and talk and reduce the velocity more than 20%, their higher risk to go to dementia, allowing the clinician to target who will respond better to early interventions. This is something that could be done very easily and inexpensively in a family practice clinic. It, it's not a sophisticated scan, but it's telling you a lot in an older person with a neurodegenerative disease. I have gratitude for the selection committee, but also for my co-investigators. And finally, to, to my family. I, I have a lot of gratitude to my family, my children, my wife, that support me in those lost hours of research. You need to have a very good support in your family to do all this. <music>